Morris has a really uh, high hit rate on magic surfboards. Um, all shapers are capable of producing them from one time or another, um, but Morris seems to have a very high ratio of, of magic to non-magic. The thing to think about with Morris with his designing is that he's really he works off a really razor sharp surfing instinct, you know, about what the board's doing underfoot. Morris has been a, a you know, he was one of the first guys to pioneer single concave through a surfboard and, and effectively blend it with bees so, so it became the sort of super high performance machine that it is today. And he was also one of the first to really, I think, hone in on toe board technology. So, you know, those toe boards, they got smaller and smaller. Morris made them smaller and smaller. Um, he was down here experimenting with Ross. <laughs> I, Honestly, I just can't imagine the sort of crap they've got up to over the years. Uh, the last thing you need when you're hauling ass at um, 40, 50 kilometres an hour into a 30 foot wave is something that's going to slow you down. What it ended up producing was this extraordinary surfboard, an extremely small, very deep concave, uh, a really hard concave. Uh, there's no give in the curves at all, um, and and he really works to like take the flex out of the board because he just wants that board to lift purely, you know. Today, Bells is like six to ten feet, and I surfed a six foot board all day. And, uh, you know, it's not always the easiest thing to paddle around, but uh, on a wave, it's just fleet of foot, and you know, you don't feel inhibited at all about what's going on with it. There's a little board that he's had for a while, like a 510, with a, with a double stringer configuration out near the rail. Um, really thick wood, and it just holds that board so still and stiff. And you can surf that board in the most extraordinary ways, absolutely full throttle, and, and you'll just pace out pretty much any board in the water easily. And Kelly took the board up to uh, uh, Queensland and surfed it with Ter Trevor Hendy, uh, his tow partner at Big Kira, and the thing was just a rocket ship, you know, like I've seen footage of Kelly riding that board and just going, oh man, mate, you should have that at Bells.